All right, guys, we're just going to do some fooling around testing. Stick man tuned. I don't know. Maybe eight bird. Something like that. Average meter. Old mud duck two pill back there that grabbed out of the closet. But the radio versus that radio. That radio is one watt carrier. Zero birds zero bird watts from a one watt carrier because it's spectrally pure. This was done by a guy out of Texas that does the uh the four to one 100% modulation on a spectrum analyzer and he really don't even pay attention to the watt meter at all so this radio I think may do 10 watts PEP that's it I don't know but anyway we're gonna check it out let's see what we got here on that radio with a two pill in average So what maybe 20 watts oh yeah over 100 watts average go to peak now it's 300 watts at the top and So that's over 200. So let's switch radios and see what the, the difference is. Since I know that this radio is not going to do any average watts, we'll see if the peak is the same over 200 on the meter. We'll be back. All right. We're, uh, Got this hooked up. I know this is on low, which I run on low. About a one and a half watt carrier, uh, well, one and a quarter watts. I've already checked it into a dummy load. And I've already just loading. Still got the same old mud duck and two pill back there from long ago for testing. And I can tell that this radio is not gonna work. Cause you can go back and watch the first part how the reflect was real low yeah hello oh yeah you can see it dead keys higher more toward 50. you can see the reflect why is the reflect just taking a radio loading it into a a two pill why is that making the reflect tire hmm crazy but anyway we'll just give us a quick test oh yeah nope just a little over 50 on average I'm gonna peak We'll see if we get up over 200 on the peak. Hello. Uh, one, 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 one. Nope. Not even over 200 on peak. And that's supposed to be spectrally pure on a spectrum analyzer. Four to one. No, I don't think that radio is going to work. We're going to have to have somebody retune that. That ain't going to work. And that concludes our test of goofing around. I'll put the 148 back in because it rocks and rolls. Guys, we're back with a General E. And I got uh, two more over here to test. I got a 2950 and a Galaxy 44. All the old, old school 2950s. Uh, First gen 
orange display but uh, this also was tuned by the spectrally pure spectrum analyzer guy and uh, I don't know what it's what's going on but I'm I'm not impressed with what he's got going on still running the two pill for testing so uh, let's see and you can see we are on low power it's on low power which is below two watts and again this radio loads into the two pill with really high reflected watts <clears throat> let me switch hands a little more steady almost a hundred watt dead key out of a generally loading into this two pill oh yeah hello no bird watts forward or our average watts we we'll go to peak oh yeah still under 200 watts which the 148 from stickman did over 200 watts and had the best reflect loading into the two pill so let's try these guys we'll be back and to conclude this 2950 old school done by stickman and these 2950s they just don't they're not swing monsters by any means but still got the same test two pill average power about 10 watts about 50 watts oh yeah just a tad over 50 I'm good at peak oh yeah over 200 oh and it loads a little bit high on the reflect so it's something to be said about a cobra they just work they love being run with amplifiers so like i said i'm gonna put that 148 back in line and that concludes the test of the exports.